Well, first and foremost, I want to thank everybody for uh, coming today and also reiterate uh, our appreciation for our fans uh, and community as a whole for their support during this transition as well as, um, you know, during the, uh, the uh, period where we were off. We're really excited to get back, you know, started playing, and, um, uh, and I think our guys are really excited as well. In taking a look at our organization and uh, just the overall development, specifically as we enter into this season, um, there's a few things that stand out uh, as we approach things and uh, will help us in our overall development on and off the floor. One, just a commitment to the same approach that we've had in place uh, the last couple years that we've been here. Uh, two, uh, continuing to evolve in the areas that uh, are associated with high-performing teams. Three, uh, when we talk about expectations, expectations for us remain the same. Uh, they're based on the internal standards that we have established and live by on a day-to-day -day basis within the walls of our practice facility. And lastly, uh, we touched on this the last time we were together, uh, being an organization and a team that is focused on how we're going to go about accomplishing our goals and not just talking about what we want to accomplish. Um, in my conversations with Scott and the front office team, we're all in agreement that despite this being a shortened year, we have to take the same approach. We have to continue to be a team, an organization that grinds out our work every day without uh, expectation or entitlement. As I said last season, at the end of the year, um, we want to continue to evolve as a team that um, has the qualities of the highest performing teams in pro sports. Things like great communication, attention to detail, uh, execution, um, recognizing situations you know, within the year and within the game, and uh, making the necessary sacrifices to be an elite team. We took major strides in this area in these areas uh, last season. And um, our players and our coaches deserve a lot of credit for that. I think that as we continue to progress in these areas, uh, these will be the, the areas that will help define us as we move forward. Uh, as I said earlier, our, our expectations, when we talk about them, they're consistent. They're based on the standards we've put in place here within the walls of our facility and that we've lived by on a day-to-day -day basis uh, for the last several years. We want to be a team that plays with a defensive disposition. We want to be a team that um, you know, brings an intensity level to the floor each time we take the, we take the court. We want to be a team that uh, displays discipline during periods of success, during periods of adversity, and also during periods of monotony uh, that take place during an NBA year. We also want to build on last season. Uh, we want to continue to establish uh, a standard of play that uh, is in place regardless of the opponent, uh, the schedule, or the location of the game. And lastly, uh, as I mentioned earlier, we want to continue to be a team that's focused on controlling what we can control and how we're going to accomplish the goals that we set uh, versus talking about what we want to do. And in the process of that, you know, proving to ourselves that we are serious enough competitors um, to make the necessary sacrifices to be, to be considered a, a, an elite team year in and year out. Um, I'm supremely confident that we'll be able to accomplish these things. Uh, I've got tremendous confidence in Scott, his staff, and our players. Um, I think we all know that there's going to be ups and downs through the year. There's going to be um, you know, emotional swings within the schedule. Uh, how we deal with those times, uh, how we manage through them will ultimately be you know, very definitive for us and who we are as a team. Um, we have a, a very healthy respect for what's ahead of us, but we've taken that approach every year that we've been in place and understand that you know, last season's over and we need to go back to square one and, and continue the process. Um, we've gotten to this point by learning from the past, but also really focusing on the present and committing to the ideal that the results will take care of themselves as long as we stay committed to the internal standards that we have and the consistency that we display to those. Um, 
again, when it comes to uh, our achievement level, uh, we also want to be able to prove to ourselves, as I said before, that we'll make the necessary sacrifices to be considered an elite team year in and year out. Um, we're excited to start the year. Our guys are excited. They've come back uh, ready to go. 